Hi. You're looking great in your lab coat. Thank you, I love my lab coat. My yeah. favorite thing. It's cool. Doctors could allow you. Yeah. <laughs> okay, how did I pronounce your name right? Yes, you did. You pronounced it perfectly. Scodelario. Well yeah. Okay. Very good. Because I would say it uh, would be in the original like Kaya Scodelario because mm -hmm. it sounds like an Italian name. It's Italian, yes. My mum's Brazilian and it's her surname, but her ancestors are Italian. Mille Baci. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, just a few questions about um, the making of the movie. So what mm -hmm. was your hardest day on set? Hardest day on set was probably the last kind of night shoot that we did. Um, we shot from 4 p.m. until 8 a.m. and we were covered in blood and sweat and we had to be running and it was very physical. Uh, and then I had to get on a plane two hours later. So for me, that was kind of the most stressful day I've had on set because I was worried I was going to miss my flight. Um, I was worried about breaking my leg. I was worried about, you know, everything happening. Uh, but it's actually my favorite part in the movie. So I'm really glad we did it. Mm. And your funniest moment on set? Funniest moment, probably the first day. We're always so excited on the first day that we all kind of mess around and play with the costumes and play with the props and uh, make fun of each other for our new haircuts. And uh, the, the first day is always a lot of fun. I love collecting props. So did you maybe are allowed to take a piece of it at home? I just thought I should have taken the lab coat home, but I didn't. I took the other coat. I took a kind of very cool leather camel coat that I fell in love with. So I, I stole it. And now you wear it? Yes, now I wear it. <laughs> okay. And your maybe weirdest moment on set? Weirdest for me? Um, probably filming in the lab with uh, Patricia Clarkson because I was so honored to get to share a scene with her one on one. Hadn't done that before. Uh, and she's such a powerful actress and I couldn't quite believe that I was getting to do a scene with her. And uh, what is your best memory? Did you have maybe some moment where you maybe think about uh, every week? Um, probably the very end where we said goodbye to each other and gave each other rap presents because uh, we've never done rap presents before because we always see each other again. But for this one, we all kind of wanted to give each other a little memory of our time in Africa. And that was very special. It's a great trilogy. So how has it um, changed your life? It's changed a lot. Um, you know, it's given us so many opportunities and uh, we've managed to touch so many fans across the world. Uh, and that's really special and amazing. And I'm so glad that so many people have got to enjoy it for five years now. Your best memory was a fan, maybe some nice love letters or anything else? Um, I've never had a love letter. I did have a girl ask me to sign her arm and then she came back the next day and she tattooed it. And I was like, well, if you told me you were going to do that, I would have written it much nicer. Uh, and it got infected. So I just kind of feel bad. But she still seems happy about it. So, yeah. Great. And uh, if you, um, if there would be some kind of prequel, I think they mm -hmm. are thinking about it because of the new book. So yeah. would you be on board? No, I think it's really nice that we've done three films. Uh, and I think we're proud of these three, three films. We've told the story that we set out to tell. I also don't think anyone would believe that we're 14 anymore. Mm -hmm. So maybe it's time to let uh, a new generation take over, which could be quite nice. Mm -hmm. And uh, if there is anything you could change mm -hmm. in the movies, would there maybe be a scene or anything else that you would maybe could change if you would yeah. allow to? I would change the amount of running. We wouldn't run anywhere. We would walk slowly to places. But this running is great. It's not fun, though. I know, but it looks great on <laughs> get, screen. That's good. That's all that matters. <laughs> so um, maybe uh, some things about his running. So um, uh, how, how physically was the shooting for you? Yeah, it was very physical. This one for me wasn't as demanding. Um, poor Dylan in all three of the movies has been nonstop. I mean, he, ha he is in amazing shape purely because of how hard he has to work every day on set. Uh, with this one, I had a few stunts towards the end and there was some running, but I think the second one was definitely the physically the hardest for all of us.